What's up you guys? It's me, Dan Luna, bringing you guys here with another little tutorial. These tutorials are pretty much just to get you started on your JTAG or RGH. They're not intended to fully help you through everything in life with your JTAG or RGH. These are just super basic things so you guys can get started and start modding ASAP. That's basically what these are for. Alright, this video pretty much is for Freestyle Dash. How to get Freestyle Dash on your console and also how to install games onto Freestyle Dash. Because lots of you guys have no idea how to do that and you guys keep asking me. I'm going to show you all in this video. All right, first off, below, there's going to be a link. That first link, you're going to click that. You're going to get this little folder. Yes, this Freestyle Dash folder. This is all you need to do to get it to your console. All right, all you got to do, get this little sexy folder. Boom, drag it to your desktop. Soon as that's done, open this little thing wherever your USB is. Come on, open, open Sesame. All right, sorry about that. But once you open up your flash drive, all you're going to have to do is drag it into your flash drive. Now from this, we will need to upload this file to your Xbox. How we can do that? We're gonna plug in this flash drive in your Xbox, and I will guys, sh I will show you guys what to do from your Xbox. All right, I'll see you guys there in a bit. All right, once you're on your Xbox, all you're gonna do is go to your whatever you're gonna have your XCX menu. It's either gonna be in Reset or My Games. You're gonna head over to XCX menu. Press B because you honestly, I wouldn't even sign in. It reduces your chance of getting banned. It increases, 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 increases your chance of getting banned, which is a big no-no. All right, what you're going to want to do is you're going to see this file. You're going to press Y. Then you're going to want to copy this file. After you do that, press A to copy to like select it. Press right on your D-pad till you get right here. Once you get here, press Y again, and you're going to want to paste it. Okay, once it would be done, it's going to say it's done. Okay, once you, it's done, you're going to click A on it. Oh my god, but this is 775. My other, mine says 735. It's okay. It's the same exact thing, I promise. Once you do that, you're going to hit default XEX. Go down, on, press down on your D-pad. Hover over it, press A to install it. Except yours will not look exactly like this. It's going to say freestyle dash FSD in the middle of the screen. And it's not gonna look just like it's kind of gonna look. I'll show you exactly how it would look if you were running it on the default skin. Because I customized my skin. But it would look somewhat like this. As you guys can tell, this is how it would actually look. With that little blue and yellow, that's how you're gonna see it. Except mine's like this, because I love this one. <laughs> that's what I love about Freestyle Dash. You can. I'll reboot it later. I don't need it. Alright, once you are here, you're pretty much set up. But what about the games? I'll tell you that right now. All right, Luna needs to install a game, so I will show you how to do that. What you're gonna want to do is go up, just press go up, go to DVD extract, put in your game, then press OK. You want to make sure you include a system update folder. You need this. You need it. You need it. You need it. All right, then let it read. Hopefully, it reads. I hope. All right, you're gonna want to change this. Hover your your HDD into your games folder. If you guys remember on my last tutorial, I showed you guys how to create this folder. All you gotta do is go into XCX menu, and where your hard drive is, where all those all these files were, just press Y and put create new folder and name it as games. You're gonna select this, then select Y. And then as you can tell, it's hard drive to games, and then whatever your output is. And then the game title, start Grand Theft, Grand Theft Auto 4. All right, let's start this copy. You're going to press start copy. You're going to want to make sure. You guys can tell that it says 0 megabytes out of like 4,000, blah, 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 blah. It should go up to around 7,000, near 7,000. When it's done, it should say, like mine says 6740. Okay, as you guys saw that right now, how it just went, you see how it did that? That's bad. That means either your disk is dirty, or it's dirty, or it's fucked up, or it's dirty. It's one of the options. If you guys want to do it, you could clean it with the good old, this is what I do, I use toothpaste. Yes, I, it sounds weird, but you honestly, you rub it in with toothpaste, the shiny part of the CD, you rub it in, rub it in, just keep rubbing it in with toothpaste, oh jeez. Rub it like you mean it, and then... You would just gently rinse it off, then get a little cloth, a lint-free cloth. 
clean it down, wipe it down. But if this was installed correctly, it would say 231 files out of 235, 231 files. That would be the exact same number. And then with the megabytes, it would be the same amount. It wouldn't say zero out of 6740. It would be 6740 out of 6740. And then once you would say that, you would click done or finish, whatever it says at the bottom. And then this is what, this is a really important step that lots of people don't know. I've seen tutorials. I could not find a tutorial that did this correct. I. I've looked and I've looked. When I first found out how to do this, I was so happy because I had to figure this out on my own. What you want to do first, this is what they lots of them show you. All right, you're going to want to go to your, you're going to want to add. Once you add it, basically, I'm going to show you right here because I already have it made. It's going to look just like this, except you're going to want to change path. Okay, remember, I'm going to count. You're going to need to count too. You're going to go to HDD. You're going to go to games. As soon as you do that, press Y. All right, you see how it says hard drive slash game slash? All right, think about it. Two slashes, scan death two. You're going to leave it as two, two. And then you're going to put, select both of these as Xbox 360. After that, you're going to want to press X to save it. Once you press X to save, you should go back over here. You should have your thing up here. Okay, next what you want to do is scan. After that, you're going to want to start your manual scan. And at the bottom below, it's going to say, you should start getting these little numbers, scanning this, that, 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 blah, 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 blah. Okay? Then, once that is done scanning, oh, so now it works. Okay. You would go to your Xbox 360 games, and as you can tell, they would all, they're all going to be right here. All your games that you have in that folder are going to also be here. And as you guys saw, when I went on XX menu, had all those lists of games, it's going to show the exact same way for you. I could promise you it's going to look the same exact way. All right, on my next tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to get Dash Launch. Set up Dash Launch and the plugins and set up everything you need to do to go online. I'm going to start that tutorial in a little bit, all right? Honestly, I hope this helped you out. If you already have Freestyle Dash, awesome. If you didn't know how to, if you already had Freestyle Dash, but you didn't know how to install the games, because... Some tutorials are stupid and then forget the most important part. Leave a thumbs up if this honestly helped you, all right? I'm going to make one more tutorial. Hopefully, that's all my tutorials I'm going to need for you guys that are modding to get yourself started with modding. That's my goal is just to help you guys get started, all right? I'm going to upload another sexy video today, probably on Black Ops 2. Maybe. I'm thinking about Black Ops 2. It will most likely be on Black Ops 2. What is it? <laughs> I don't know. You guys are going to have to stay tuned to find out, all right? I'll see you guys later. Bye. Oh, 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 oh,